This story takes place on the night of February 18, 1930, in a freezing observatory dome in Flagstaff, Arizona, at the Lowell Observatory. The search for Planet X had been ongoing for decades. Astronomers believed there had to be a ninth planet whose gravity was subtly tugging on the orbits of Uranus and Neptune, yet no one had ever seen it. The task of finally locating this elusive world fell to a young, determined 24-year-old self-taught astronomer named Clyde Tombaugh. Tombaugh's method was laborious and mind-numbing. He spent hours comparing photographic plates taken days apart using a machine called a blink comparator. He would manually flip back and forth between the two plates, watching for any tiny speck of light that shifted position, which would indicate a moving object, a planet, comet, or asteroid, against the fixed distant stars. On that historic night, Tombaugh was comparing two plates of the Gemini constellation, a process he had repeated thousands of times with no success. His eye ached, and the sheer repetition was exhausting. The immense time pressure was also palpable. If he didn't find the planet soon, the project risked being shut down by the observatory, ending his career and the long-held dream of Planet X. He pressed the lever of the blink comparator, and the view instantly switched from plate A to plate B. He pressed it again, plate B to plate A. It was in that single, focused, one-minute interval while his eye moved across the identical star fields that he saw it. A faint 15th magnitude star-like point of light jumped slightly from one position to the next. It was exactly the movement predicted for a planet beyond Neptune. Tomba, stunned but composed, checked the movement again and again. The shift was minuscule yet unmistakable. That single minute of precise observation, after years of thankless searching, confirmed the existence of a new world. Tomba had found Pluto. Had he been distracted? Had he blinked at the wrong second? Or had he simply dismissed that faint smudge as a photographic flaw? The discovery would have been missed. The observation was so quick and subtle that the entire celestial body could have remained hidden for decades longer. That one minute secured his place in history, completed the traditional map of our solar system, and proved that even the most monumental discoveries can hinge on a fraction of time. Subscribe now and turn on the bell icon.